Good morning, class, and welcome to us at the first day of school. Before we proceed with our lesson, kayo muna ay makinig sa ating ganda. Hindi na lalayo sa'yo ang tunay ng mundo. Marami sa atin na buhay ng tulad mo. Di makita, di marinig, minsan na uutan. Patungo sa hinagad na buhay ng panay. Okay, kung kung saan ang aking kinanta? All about PWDs, or Persons with Disabilities. And that will be connected to our lesson for today. And our lesson for today is all about Intersubjectivity. Or in Filipino, may ipagkapwa tao. At the end of the lesson, we're going to answer these questions. Question number one. What does it mean to be humans? Again, what does it mean to be humans? And question number two. How does one's relationship with fellow human beings help him understand and enrich his own humanity? Again, how does one's relationship with fellow human beings help him understand and enrich his own humanity? Subjectivity. Before we we are part of society, yet we are still different individuals living in this society with different appearances or points of view. Tayo na katira sa isang ipunan, pero may tayong kanya-kanyang pananaw sa issue. Noon ang tawag namin sa mga tao may kapansanan, we call them handicaps. Pero ngayon, hindi ba yan? Ang tawag sana ngayon ay PWDs or Persons with Disabilities. Sa palagay ninyo, ba't kaya tinawag na Persons with Disabilities? Or bakit na unang person kaysa yung kanilang disabilities? May tanga kayo. Kasi nga, kahit na meron silang kapansanan, they are still considered persons mga tao pa rin sila. So, we'll talk about the talents and contributions of PWDs and underprivileged. Alam niyo ba, ang PWD ay hindi lang tumutukoy sa kapalsan ng physical, kundi tumutukoy din yan. When you are hearing impaired, hindi ka makarinig. Diabetic, asthmatic, or cystic fibrotic. Yan ay kinatawag din mga PWDs or persons with disabilities. May kailan ba kayong tao na sikat despite his disabilities ay meron pa rin siya na doon maganda sa kanyang lipunan or contribution sa kanyang lipunan. I bet kailan ninyo si Nick Boydsik na isang motivational speaker. Napagaling niyang magsalika, mag-motivate ng mga listeners niya, despite his disabilities, wala po siyang kamay, eh wala din po siyang paa. But despite that, siya po ay isang magaling na speaker, and of course, magaling din po siyang swimmer and athlete. Yan po si Nate Boyce. And of course, pwede po tayong pinay na ipinagmamalaki, Filipino-American na si Jessica Cox. Sa din po ay wala din po siyang kamay, pero she can fly an airplane. Siya po ay isang piloto. Yes, you're very right. Siya po ay isang piloto. She can fly an airplane. So apart from PWD, we are also going to talk about the underprivileged or all about poverty. Alam niyo ba ang poverty ay kahirapan ay hindi lang tumutukoy sa usaping pinasal, kundi hindi tumutukoy din sa ating usaping pangkalusugan. Education, empowerment, and working conditions. For your activities, you're going to answer these questions. Question number one. How do you react when you see persons with disabilities and street children? And why? Number two. Listen to Michael Jackson's song entitled, Man in the Mirror. And based on the song, when does our own image become that of our own neighbors? So that's it for today. Have a nice day, everyone. Once again, I'm Nestor.